Hey there, Royal fans. Thank you for joining me today. Let's get into today's juicy story. It isn't Meghan Markle that Netflix wants. It's Prince Harry and his family. The nonsense about wanting to get out of the media spotlight and Prince Harry being triggered every time he heard a camera's click may have fooled some people, but it didn't fool us. The reason for leaving the royal family was to thrust themselves firmly into the spotlight and earn as much money as possible hawking the royal title around America. Prince Harry and Meghan Markle's intentions were revealed by an unlikely source. While we were forever told that the big media companies in the US were falling over themselves to work with the Sussexes, it would appear that wasn't the case at all. If you have companies lining up to work with you, you certainly wouldn't be shopping yourself around like some novice writer hoping to catch the eye of a charitable publisher. And yet shop themselves around is exactly what Meghan Markle and Prince Harry did, according to Netflix CEO Reed Hastings. During an interview on CNBC, Reed claimed, I'm so excited about the deal. They smart. They were shopping it around across all major companies. And I think we really put together the best complete package. Reed Hastings comments don't quite match up with what Harry and Meghan have been telling us. When the Netflix deal was signed, there was a statement of sorts from Meghan Markle and Prince Harry, addressing the kind of contents their fans can expect. Our focus will be creating content that informs but also gives hope. As new parents, making inspirational family programming is also important to us. Now that all sounds well and good, but when prompted in his interview with CNBC, Netflix CEO Hastings commented, It's going to be epic entertainment. We're going to do a wide range of entertainment with them. I can't tell you any more than that about it at this point, but I think it'll be some of the most exciting, most viewed content next year. When someone says a show on Netflix is informative and provides hope, and has an inspirational family theme to it, it seems to be going against the epic entertainment and exciting version. Netflix wants epic entertainment, and it believes that Prince Harry is a doorway to the real-life version of The Crown. So, we know that Netflix loves The Crown. It's one of their best ever shows. However, if you're a Netflix exec, you're already thinking about what could possibly top that. What could be better than actors playing the role of British royalty? Well, what if we had an actual British prince? Now that's money. All they have to do is let him and his wife produce some woke nonsense, while in return they can press on with the real agenda behind the content deal they signed. Access to the inside scoop on the most famous family on the planet. Ho, oh, cryptic but smart. Unfortunately, you know, it's all he, he, he say. We have to actually wait and see what time reveals. But I'm interested to see where it goes. Let me know what you think, guys. Also, please like and subscribe. I hope to catch you guys again tomorrow. Thank you for watching and goodbye for now.